Hi everyone, today we have a new video review and as you can see this time I'm going to show you the fresh release from ICM and it's quite interesting set for all diorama builders because in one box you will get all of the necessary accessories for Luftwaffe airfield equipment and as you can see it comes in 148 scale so quite a popular choice I would say and what I have here is the final shape of this release and it means you will get exactly the same stuff if you order it for example from Madelimex so it's also quite nice and the kit number is 48409 so we have all of those items depicted here on the box art but obviously we'll be checking them closer and the box size is typical for such release from ICM so here is comparison with my hand also here on the side you'll find some information about this kit so here I can show it closer and then I need to check it myself so there are 320 parts for assembly of the aircraft armament and 132 parts for assembly of airfield equipment so quite a package for such I would say simple item for the first side and here you can see also some side view for items which were shown also on the box art but of course there should be the separate guides inside the box so I just need to cut through the plastic seals in the meantime I can remind you that also uh, ICM was releasing a lot of aircraft kits recently in a 148 scale so in case you are interested in checking them then definitely take a look at Madelimex webshop and also at my YouTube channel where I was showing them in a bit closer view and I think it's a, a really decent items coming recently from ICM so that's why it's worth uh, taking a look. So the box structure is typical for ICM as you can see this flexible top cover which was kind held in place with these plastic seals and then we have sturdy white cardboard box if I open it here is what we have inside so one plastic bag with all necessary items and I'm going to open it right now because it's a resealable plastic bag so it should be a rather quick thing to do and then we will talk a bit more about what is included here so on the top I can see we have the various armament and it is supplied on four identical plastic sprues so I will show them right now and I will show you only one because there is no need to show the same parts again and again so just give me a moment and it might be familiar to some of you because this kit or these parts were actually included into some previous releases as well but here we get them as a part of the new release so as you can see we get various bombs and you don't have to use everything at once so some of those parts might stay in your spare parts box and this is also quite a good thing and it might be handy for the future builds as well so the design here I would say it's quite classic as well so we have the bombs separated into two halves we have the tail fins molded separately and if I flip over this plastic sprue we have also some guiding elements for these parts so it will be easier to align them together and I think this is quite smart design and it will be uh, making the whole assembly a bit faster and easier. Next we continue with uh, another plastic sprue so this one will be handy for the wooden structure which was built usually on the airfield I would say the checkpoint so as you can see these wooden panels do not have any texture they have only recess panel lines which are also not that deep so try not to lose them with the paint code and also primer code but overall the idea is quite simple and it's really nice that it is included here as well and we also have the oxygen bottles here we have various drums oil drums and if I flip over again even on this parts for the checkpoint we have the guiding element so as you can see these panels should be easy to combine together and I'm really I would say thankful for this thing because uh, sometimes manufacturers just assume that you can combine the panels uh, precisely without any pain and then it turns out ugly so next we continue with the special crane uh, the one which was used for the servicing of the aircraft and as you can see here we have the chain molded in plastic some modellers will be actually happy to see this because they don't want to deal with P parts here it is supplied as pre-shaped element and as you can see we have it here on the um, left part of the frame and if I flip over this sprue again there are some guiding elements so 
this crane support should be or crane base should be assembled out of several parts so that's why there are certain elements which will help you with this and then another thing is uh, the stowage boxes and the jerry cans or the oil jerry cans so here as you can see we have the um, three sprues of the same type and they look rather nice. We also have uh, storage boxes molded together with the handles. And if I flip over them, so as you can see, we have also special guiding elements for the armament. So if you would like to place it in those boxes, you are free to go with the bombs which we saw on the first frame. And now to the assembly manual. So we have it printed as a separate brochure, which is quite tightly fit inside the box so I just need a bit of time to take it out and here it is so let's close the lenses a bit maybe like this and zoom out now you can see that it's a brochure with a short history note here we have the paint chart in ICM paint colors next we continue with the parts map and we also find here the decals so decals as far as you can see are printed uh, specially for this kit except of this uh, German armament decals because it was also released as the separate set but another decal sheet is uh, special for this kit because here we get the various stencils and also these black lines and I think professional modelers will try to replicate these stripes with the airbrush and masks but it's already your decision whether you would like to go this way because obviously it will require a bit more work everything starts with the bomb loader so it's not a crane it's a bomb loader which basically acts a bit like a crane but as you can see it should be assembled out of several parts so be ready for this and next I'm trying to flip over the page because here we continue no we actually get the tripod crane as well we get the uh, box for the 50 kilo bombs we also get the box for 250 bombs and then we get the jerry cans we get the fuel barrels here you can see also the uh, booth for the checkpoint next we continue with the step ladder uh, then we have a separate barrel assembly and then there is also aircraft armament assembly guide next we have more of the bombs assembled here and there as you can see they are separated by the types and then there is also a marking guide for these items so we have the booth we have also the um, special checkpoint parts we have the boxes with the stencils and this is actually a cool thing that they decided to include all of the stencils even for the boxes and of course for the armament we also get it included here so it's quite a package and i don't think you will be able to use everything at once so it might be even sufficient for uh, several builds and it should be already available you can get it in Madenimex webshop together with some aircraft from ICM and of course I will be happy to hear your opinion so do not forget to write it here in the comment section below and press the like button if you like this video and you would like to support <laughs> me and I will see you in the next video review as usual and thank you for joining me today and bye